Sheldon Nibbles update. December 22, 2015. Sheldon. Dritz so. We arrive in joy. The last phases of the delivery process is underway. What can somewhat delay this process is Christmas. The Ascended Masters see this time of the year as they do early May, as a holy time and seek to clearly observe this sacred part of the Gregorian year. Hence, those who are sending these heavenly blessings can temporarily delay deliveries. However, despite a divine delay these special gifts are to be delivered to you. Since ancient times, this time of the year has held special significance. Even in the time of Atlantis, the end of one year, and the beginning of a new year was celebrated with special rituals and ceremonies. Be gracious and joyous that this time is as well to be the start of your blessings. Remember how long this has taken and bless with appreciation what you are to receive. Be ready to use this moment to start to use these funds to manifest your dreams. Thank all and let your group and yourself take this new year in hand and with detail figure out how this divine vision is to take shape. Know that with these blessings comes a new reality and new governance. As you look around your globe, you find how this change is taking place. The reality is that this world of yours can no longer function as it has previously. Desperately needed changes are popping up everywhere. The water crisis is one of the most apparent. Most of your world lacks a truly safe water supply. The resources to provide it are there. Yet, they are unavailable because of the politics and supposed expense. Blessings are to be given to you, so you can use these humanitarian funds to solve this immense crisis. This is only one of the many infrastructure problems that are to be resolved. Many others such as roads, bridges and even such simple things as railroads require some sort of innovative thinking. We know that a great many people are ready to demonstrate the solutions needed for success. In addition, you need to give the globe's children the means to absorb a truly high quality and productive education. It is a matter of providing a good foundation for all by producing enough food to end starvation forever. We have been discussing numerous problems that are on the verge of overwhelming your reality. As consciousness grows, you can start to see how easily these many problems can be alleviated. The vital key is to isolate the dark minions who control this realm and to simply let the light in. This is the gist of what we are doing. We have watched you grow, and seen how the dark manipulates you and seeks to keep you at a certain level of control. Our liaisons are steadfastly working to see that these scalawags are swiftly isolated from you. Once you are free of them, you can easily use your innate abilities to forge a better world. It is this new reality that we intend to visit and to help you to finally finish your long journey back to full consciousness. It is in this light that we have journeyed here in such great numbers. Our mentors stand ready to assist you across the final bumps in this very long road. It is this process that is driving us toward success. Millennia ago, you were suddenly ripped from your true lights by the dark priests of Atlantis. This technology was not yet capable of permanently altering you. Heaven saw this as an opportunity to fashion a special group of humans. These were extremely capable of aiding the children of Ankara in their own journey to the light and to full consciousness. You are to transform this galaxy by what you are to learn. And to pass on this knowledge by the great mercy that is innate in all humans. You are to provide an enormous service to all in physicality and to become great role models, which are the stuff of legend. As we have stated, you are in the final stages of this journey. We are here to record these mighty times, and to assist you, in the last vestiges of your moving the glories associated with your return to full consciousness. You are to be reunited with your spiritual and space families. You are as noted here on the very edge of your move into your greatest adventure, the fabled teachers of the light among the Anchorans. Namaste. We are your ascended masters. We know just how hard it is to see the many blessings that you deserve, delayed by circumstances beyond your control. Various machinations by the Dark's remaining agents have forced certain special security measures to be duly enforced. As these long-promised monies become available, Rejoice and remember the sacred significance of this time of the year. Graciously accept these divine gifts and use your sense of mercy in determining how best to either use or distribute them. 
these gifts are to be the start of a grand prosperity that is to be showered upon this orb. Let this be a time of endings and beginnings. Let it be a moment for you to demonstrate your resolute belief in the power of the light. Help those in need and start those projects that are to aid humanity in general. Be positive and ready to carry out what your inner heart and mind truly believes in. As we approach this most significant occasion, look upon this event as a time when the true unity of humanity is to finally shine on a global basis. Wonderful things are to happen because deep inside we all really care for one another. This love is to reflect the growing level of consciousness that you all feel inside you. It was only a few years ago that many of the incidents that have happened would have led to some type of global conflagration. This growth of spirit is most encouraging. You are beginning to expand the level of applied mercy on a worldwide basis. Hence, remain positive and let this wondrous feeling continue to flow and to grow. New governance is to manifest. This new time is eventually to permit us to appear and teach many things that you need to know about your past, present, and future. Sitting in the midst of all this is the eternal now. Your sacred task is to take both, your growth in consciousness and in spirit, and forge a new realm that is to be the precursor of a new human society. Long ago, we were denied our chance to turn Atlantis into a new amalgam of the spirit of Lemuria, merged joyfully with the technologies of Atlantis. Ever since that time, you have floundered in the prison that is limited consciousness. Because of a series of exemplary lives, Heaven eventually turned us masters into your faithful overseers. We have applied mercy and grace along with a showering of good works to keep the higher sparks of humanity alive. Presently, a great heavenly miracle is to complete our mutual times in the dark. It is this new realm, which beckons us and is to allow us to meet and share our wisdom with you. It is a divine moment when all of us are to get to welcome each other and rejoice. Today, we carried on with our weekly message. Many events are now ready to manifest. We thank the Creator and bless those happenings that are shortly to embrace us. Let us take this holiday season and use it to both begin, and celebrate a most amazing time for all of humanity. No, dear ones, that the countless supply and never-ending prosperity of heaven are indeed yours. So be it Salamat Gajan. Salamat Ja. Syrian for B1, and be enjoy.